And here it is, the last lap in the season-long race for the trophy. Millions of viewers from around the world are tuning in for the biggest final in club football, the Champions League final. A warm welcome from me, Derek Ray, joined here on the commentary box, as always, by the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere building to fever pitch, we're just minutes away from kickoff time. It's Paris Saint-Germain taking on Sevilla. Well, Derek, you just wonder what those players are thinking right now. Some will be nervous, some will be excited, and some may be anxious. But once that whistle blows, we're going to be in for an absolute classic here. And here's how the lineup looks for PSG. Gianluigi Donnarumma begins in goal. Lucas Hernandez plays alongside Marquinhos in central defence. And the striker today is Victor Osimhen. And this is how Sevilla will line up. Marcos Acuna plays with Jesus Navas in the fullback positions. Suso starts with Lucas Ocampos in the wide positions. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. Very effective passing sequence. Let's up here. Oh, keeper dealt with it. And the short option preferred. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Hakimi. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shout. What are you expecting to see from him, Stuart? Well, Derek, over the years, he's scored so many goals. It's his ability to come short and then spin in behind defense. Oh, wait, Stuart, they might score! Chance, maybe! Rewarded for that brilliant high press. And nicely struck! Well, the goalkeeper's life wasn't made quite as difficult as might have been the case. Trying to up and up the defence. Well, the attack carried promise, but petered out. Good example of pressing without the ball. Loic Bade. Torres Sumare on the ball Torres moving the ball more than decently but can they take the lead top class defending Dembele and players waiting at the far post oh incredible save and he snuffed out the danger
Dembele. Really good interception. Yusuf and Nesiri. Well, moving the ball forward, they might be in business. That'll be a severe throw. Options in the centre. Ocampos. Sumare. On to Navas. It's with Milan Skriniar. And the referee's whistle. We've reached the halfway point here at Wembley Stadium. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how this second half pans out. Now they stop them in their tracks. Breaking at pace. And the counter-attack came to nothing. He's in behind. And they scored! First goal in this season's UEFA Champions League final. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. An advantage coming into play, and rightly so. Torres. Good tackle. Well, we have 30 minutes to go. Nice looking pass. Bade. Read it superbly to take back possession. Oh, what an opportunity. And a goal! I'll tell you what, they're going to be very hard to catch now. Name on the trophy, maybe. Well, here's the replay. He's got such quick feet, hasn't he? Just look how he goes past his marker to get his shot away. That's a really good goal. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. And Nesiri. It's Torres now. Sumare. Effective challenge. Well, we have 20 minutes left in this game. Suso. Sumare on the ball. Lucas Ocampos. Just the challenge that was required. Just have to make sure they don't get caught on the counter-attack. And PSG showing good width here. Akimi. Just failing to hit the target with his pass. And it'll be a throw-in. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Teammates in the middle. And a confident clearance. Firing it towards goal. Spectacular save. Top-class goalkeeping. Dembele tasked with taking the corner. Not the best clearance. Soler, opportunity here, there it is, victory more or less guaranteed now.
Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback, and it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. Well, that's just what he wanted. He has to be happy with this performance. They've been good today. This is looking rather comfortable for them. 3-0. Gibril So. What about the stoppage time situation? Two minutes the word. Incisive pass. And you cannot argue with a hat-trick. Simply unstoppable today. Well, here's the replay. Watch how he goes past his man with such ease. And it's just a change of pace. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. out there joy and relief on one side despair and heartache on the other but we've got the right winners here they fully deserved it on the night for these players well it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond well they have to make the most of this don't they it's a great feat what an achievement from them well they don't need to be reminded about what comes next it's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. <laughs> the Champions League winners, Paris Saint-Germain. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural.